Amazon is making a massive leap in the world of AI by replacing the existing AI behind Alexa with a cutting-edge model from Anthropic, known as Claude. This move isn't just a routine update, it's a significant shift that could redefine how we think about smart assistants. Imagine a more advanced Alexa that doesn't just respond to your commands, but engages in more natural, context-aware conversations. But what does this mean for the average user? Let's dive in and explore the details. Amazon has been working on this upgrade for quite some time, under the internal project name Remarkable Alexa, or Project Banyan. Initially, they aimed to enhance Alexa with their own in-house AI technology. However, during the testing phase, things didn't go as planned. Amazon's AI struggled with responsiveness, sometimes taking up to six or seven seconds to reply. Now, in today's world, where we've all gotten used to instant answers from AI like ChatGPT or Google Assistant, that kind of delay is just unacceptable. It's the difference between feeling like you're talking to a machine and having a seamless conversation with something that feels almost human. Seeing the limitations of their own technology, Amazon made a bold decision to partner with Anthropic, a San Francisco-based AI research company founded by some former OpenAI experts. Anthropic has been making waves in the AI industry, particularly with their Claude model, which excels at understanding context and maintaining more natural, human-like conversations. In testing, Claude outperformed Amazon's AI, delivering the kind of responsiveness and conversational fluidity that users expect today. So why Claude? Why partner with another company instead of continuing to develop their own AI? The answer lies in both performance and strategy. Claude's ability to handle complex interactions more effectively than Amazon's AI made it an obvious choice. But there's also a financial element to consider. Amazon has invested a staggering $4 billion in Anthropic, which not only solidifies their partnership, but also shows how serious Amazon is about staying at the forefront of AI technology. This investment isn't just about improving Alexa. It's a strategic move to ensure Amazon remains competitive in the rapidly evolving AI landscape. Now, let's talk about what this new version of Alexa will actually bring to the table. The upgraded Alexa promises to be far more advanced than the one we're familiar with today. You won't just be able to ask it simple questions or give basic commands. The new Alexa will be capable of understanding and executing complex, multi-step tasks from a single prompt. For instance, imagine telling Alexa, order me a pizza, draft an email to my boss, and set a reminder for my dentist appointment, and having all of that done seamlessly. It's like having your own personal assistant who knows exactly what you need when you need it. But the upgrades don't stop there. The new Alexa will also offer more personalized suggestions and advice. Let's say you're planning a trip to Bali. Alexa could help you decide what clothes to pack based on the weather forecast and your planned activities. Or if you're a news junkie, Alexa could aggregate stories tailored to your specific interests, ensuring you're always up to date on the topics that matter most to you. However, there's a twist. Amazon plans to offer this enhanced version of Alexa as a paid subscription service, likely costing between $5 to $10 per month. This is a significant departure from the free Alexa service we've all come to know. And importantly, this fee won't be included in your Amazon Prime subscription. It'll be an additional cost. Amazon is betting that the advanced features will be compelling enough to justify the price tag, but it's definitely a risky move. Asking users to pay for something that's been free for years is always tricky. Some insiders at Amazon are reportedly skeptical about whether customers will be willing to make the switch, especially when many are already paying $130 a year for Prime. So, why is Amazon rolling out this paid model now? The answer lies in economics and competition. Despite the popularity of Alexa, with over 500 million Alexa-enabled devices sold, the voice assistant division hasn't been as profitable as Amazon would like. The company's leadership is under pressure to turn Alexa into a revenue-generating asset. They see 2024 as a pivotal year to prove Alexa's value in the market. If Amazon can convince even 10% of its roughly 100 million active Alexa users to upgrade to the paid version, it could mean at least $600 million in annual revenue, assuming they opt for the lower end of the price range. That's a big incentive for Amazon to make this work. This move also reflects a broader shift in Amazon's strategy. Traditionally, Amazon has preferred to build its technology from the ground up, 
giving them full control over the user experience and data collection. But the landscape is changing rapidly. Tech giants like Microsoft and Apple have partnered with OpenAI to integrate advanced models like ChatGPT into their products, raising the stakes in the AI race. Amazon likely felt the heat and realized that to keep up, they needed to embrace a more collaborative approach, hence the partnership with Anthropic. The AI space is evolving at breakneck speed, and companies are racing to offer the most advanced, intuitive, and human-like AI assistance. The launch of ChatGPT last year was a game-changer, showing that users want AI that can handle natural, flowing conversations, not just respond to simple commands. Amazon's new Alexa is a direct response to this shift, aiming to deliver an experience that feels less like talking to a machine and more like engaging with an intelligent assistant. Looking ahead, what else can we expect from this new Alexa? For starters, it's expected to integrate more seamlessly with other smart home devices, remembering your preferences and routines. Imagine an Alexa that knows exactly how you like your lights dimmed at night or when you want your coffee brewed in the morning. It could become a true personal assistant, anticipating your needs and adjusting your environment accordingly. There's also talk that the new AI could offer specialized interactions for kids, making it a more engaging and educational tool for families. Picture Alexa helping your kids with their homework, playing educational games, or even telling interactive bedtime stories. This could make Alexa not just a household assistant, but a key part of family life. Of course, with all these advancements come concerns about privacy and data security. As Alexa becomes more advanced and handles more sensitive information, questions arise about how this data will be used, stored, and potentially shared. Amazon hasn't provided detailed answers yet, but it's an issue that will likely come under scrutiny as the new Alexa rolls out. Users will need to weigh the benefits of these advanced features against potential privacy risks. But Amazon's AI ambitions don't stop with Alexa. They're also making strides internally with a tool called Amazon Q, which has already saved the company $260 million by automating repetitive software development tasks. This AI-powered assistant streamlines processes that used to take developers weeks, freeing them up to focus on more complex and creative projects. In addition, Amazon is pushing forward in the field of AI robotics. They recently acquired the founders of Covariant, a startup developing robotic arms that can perform common warehouse tasks with impressive dexterity. Covariant is working on what they call a large language model for robots, teaching them to understand and execute commands more intuitively. Integrating this technology into Amazon's operations could revolutionize their warehouse efficiency, making their supply chain faster and more responsive. All of this points to one thing. Amazon is doubling down on AI across the board. Whether it's through improving Alexa with Claude, enhancing internal processes with Amazon Q, or advancing robotics, the goal is clear. Leverage AI to make their services smarter, faster, and more integrated. For consumers, this means we're likely to see AI becoming an even bigger part of our daily lives. Smarter voice assistants, more automated homes, and faster, more efficient services could all be just around the corner. But it's also a time to stay informed and vigilant about how these technologies are developing, what they mean for our privacy, and how they'll impact our jobs and routines. So, what do you think? Are you ready to pay extra for a more advanced version of Alexa? Or do you believe Amazon should stick with the free model and find other ways to monetize it? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into Amazon's AI strategy, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel for more updates on AI and tech. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.